What up is Cam and welcome to Dead Man's Diary. This game has just come out on the Xbox and I've been waiting for this game for a while when I found out it's a zombie open apocalypse game. I was hoping it'd be multiplayer but it's not a single player but that will have to do. That will have to do. Um, tutorial. Yeah, I kind of want a tutorial because I don't know. But, you know, I'm usually like, you know, enable photo mode. Ooh, for like thumbnails and that. Oh, I like that a lot. Okay. Even I don't really need a tutorial because, you know, I'm kind of like a really good zombie player, if you know what I mean. Like, I am like the best zombie player there is. I'm not. I'm really not. I'm talking absolute bollocks as usual. Okay, let's go. Uh, this game features dynamic help to show beginners hints about objects and locations of processing the game. Intense of players. Players who want to focus primarily on the story, this option can be changed at any time in the game. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll just have it on. We, we probably won't take any notice of it, but we just have it on anyway. Okay. Oh, it's dark. My situation is easily explained. It was after the year 2000, when the nuclear weapons pelted down on Earth. Politicians were concerned about climate change and other problems, but no one knew that a madman was secretly building nuclear weapons. He was of the opinion that when his natural lifetime expired, not Sorry. only he would have to die, but all other people as well. Not a single human being should have the right to continue living. He devised a vicious plan with his henchmen, so that a chain reaction between his nuclear weapons and the ones of the world powers was triggered. Only very few people found sanctuary in nuclear shelters. But after more than 15 years, they realized that the scientists had been wrong. Their calculated prediction of when it would be possible to return to the Earth's surface was simply wrong. So the people have to stay in the bunker much longer than assumed. Which brings up the next inhuman problem. The supplies are not enough to keep all the people alive. Therefore, the decision was made that some survivors must leave the bunker. The decision is made by Lot. The past hours were the longest and darkest of my life. The Lot was not on my side. I was blindfolded, so that I could not find my way back to the bunker. Okay, so this is about like a nuclear war that went out in 2000. Oh. So it's a bit like Fallout really, but... It's like different. Oh, I am. Use flashlight. Oh, good God, I still cannot see fucking anything. Oh, no, wait a minute. Hang on, brightness needs to... Jesus Christ. My brightness needs to come up. Contrast. What does that look like now? Oh, do I ask? Whoa, my God! There we go. That's uh... sentenced to death, without water, food, medication, abandoned in the forest in the middle of the night. This is pure horror. If I want to have a hint of a chance, I should see to it that I get out of the forest fast. Why? What's what's in the? What's this? Oh, it shows my. Wait, what? Oh, that's photo mode. Oh. Oh, you have a diary. Okay. Day one. Now I've been abandoned here in the forest. A lot of lot has decided my fate. Whether I survive this here at all, I do not know. I need something to eat and drink. But first I should think about place to sleep. But not here in the forest. That's too dangerous. I have to find a way out of this forest. Okay. Find a way out. Health management. Oh, okay. Okay. Right, mate. It's still really sensitive. I 
hate that. <laughs> Why is it so sensitive? There you go, that's, that's, that's doable. I have no idea where I am. Maybe I should follow this path as an orientation. Normally, they lead somewhere. So yeah, so like, this game is about like, a nuclear war that went off. And... What was that? Fuck! What was that? My heart's beating out of my chest. I don't see anything. The stupid flashlight is as bright as a tea candle. That's true, you do need to get a better flashlight, my friend. As I was saying, um, I think like the people that are left out in the nuclear wasteland got turned into like. I'm stumbling I'm around dead. like a zombie with my stomach twisted. At some point, I need something to eat, otherwise, this won't end well. And now I'm already starting to talk to myself. I talk to myself quite a lot, so it's okay. We got that way, or hello, hello, hello. I hear things moving around. What is that? Hello. Who's there? It's not funny anymore. I swear anymore. to God, if I got a fucking jump scare. Oh, I swear really to take the short end of the stick. Fucking God! Damn it! Hello? What is that? A screwdriver can be very useful. Is that this? Hasn't got any moving mechanics though, so I don't know how it's making noise. Yeah, okay, it is that, but it hasn't got any moving mechanics. I don't know how it's. Uh... Am I going the right way? What has mankind done to itself? For years, they talked about global warming, CO2 diesel cars and so on and so forth but no one was expecting this oh I am very on edge oh this flashlight so shit why do I always get the shit flashlight it's bullshit Like, surely, you know, the bird taker supply me with a flashlight that I can actually see out of. Honestly, it may as well, I fucking have a candle. Fucking crap. Don't see, like, this is then. Oh. Oh, do I really want to stay here? Oh, a note. Hello, lucky finder. If you walk into the forest on the left, Parallel to the industrial area, you will find an old military container. I didn't take anything, but maybe you have use for it. Oh, a military container. That's this, right? Military's order. The contents of this container are classified. Please keep the container door closed at all times. Of course, it's locked. You know, you couldn't leave like the key in it or anything for me. You know, no. Bastard. What the fuck is that? I don't like this music. I will certainly not find the key to this uh, lock, but maybe I'll find another way to open the lock. Okay. So, can we go inside? Oh, that's me jumping. No, no, I was a jump like that before. Like. 
<laughs> oh! Oh, why? Do I need a backpack or something? I can't fucking pick anything up. It's bullshit. Uh, this is the worst possible place to set up camp. A bit too close to the edge of the forest for my taste. Maybe there's a better place in the industrial plant. I'll keep looking around. So this guy who left notes, is he... Is he dead? I assume he's dead. What the hell? Shit. I don't even have a fucking gun. Hello? Hello? Dude's writing a note, is that you? No. Okay. Oh, a pill. Nice, we're gonna be popping pills up. Popping pills? Oh, fuck it! Jesus Christ. Not only do I have a perforated liver and a beastly headache, no, now I've hurt myself. Man, I should be more careful in the future. Be more careful? It wasn't my fucking... Vault. Oh. Oh, I got a lockpick. What can I? Oh, the container. Ah, where is that? Okay, it's over there. Okay, we can get this open and have a look what's inside. Hopefully, hopefully, there's a gun or some food. Or gun and some food. That would be even better. Like, camp. Don't break lock picks because you've only got the one. Oh, so, oh god, that shows the lock picks life department. Oh Jesus. Okay. Damn it. Yeah. Gauge capture. Of a lot pick. This gauge counter is very useful for scanning objects such as beverages and canned food for radioactivity. To equip yourself with it, press RB and select. Okay. So all those beverages that I saw, like those cans in, I gotta scan them to make sure that they haven't got huge gauge counter. Contaminated. Oh. Yeah, it's a good thing that we didn't pick that up then. Because we would have grown probably an extra cock. Gauge counter. This is probably going to be the exact same, isn't it? I don't know what you think. Okay. I don't like the controls to like switch like the torch. The controls are very, very, uh, very annoying. Ugh. Can you find some food? But all the food's fucking contaminated. I might just risk it and drink one and just grow an extra arm or something. I think quite helpful. Or grow a third leg, if you know what I mean. Oh my god, where am I? Oh god, god, I'm in the train. Oh god. Um, I don't think this was meant to happen. Help! Oh god. Help! Oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay, there we go. Wait, no. No, there we go. Oh my god. God, I literally clipped through the entire fucking train. 
That was scary. Oh my god, imagine that happens in real life, you just clip through a fucking train. That would be really bad. <laughs> fucking hell! Shit! This came from the door down there. Now the fun is over. I'm not going another meter, and no, I don't want to know what's behind the door either. Neither do I. I don't want to fucking know. Can we not go down there? I mean, I'll only go down there if I got a weapon, but if I don't have a weapon, you can fuck off. You can go and do one. Oh, come on, you bitch. Please don't tell me that that, that waypoint is telling me that I need to go down there. Because if it is, I refuse. I have to go down there, aren't I? The game is going to make me go down there. I fucking know it is. Well, it's okay. Right here, we've got everything for a fire and a shelter. That took way longer than expected. I didn't realize that you were, I didn't realize I was building a fucking house. I thought that I was just gonna simply build a shelter and, you know, sleep. Right, is that really necessary to have that big of a thing? No! Sleep. Yes. Sleep. Go to fucking sleep. Because I hate this place. It makes me feel uneasy. It's a nice fire though. Don't think we're cooking anything though because I didn't get any food. Fucking will. Oh fuck. Hello. You're a bit clocky. Oh, for fuck's sake. Can I not just unlock? Can you not just knock on the door and just say hello? Excuse me, I need, I need assistance. No. Oh god, I hear it. I assume that this is my home. I'm confused. 
There's no one here, and there's no other door leading into a tunnel system or something. I could have sworn I heard noises coming from the bunker. It's a shitty day to stop thinking about it. I think I once read that dry food like flour, sugar, and chips do not take radioactivity. I should find more of that stuff. It may make you fat, but I think that's the least of my problems at the moment. Oh my god, look at all this like, stuff we got here. I've been in this bunker for... Is that... How many days? Is that... X days? And I'm out, f I'm out of supplies, therefore I have decided to leave the bunker. Did you die? Did you die a horrible, painful death? I don't think anything here is going to be contaminated. Okay, let's eat something before I die. Num, 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 num. Okay. Um. Cock the can food. What can I keep it? What, what can I, like, cook it on? Okay, so I'm going to go to bed. Okay. I'm gonna go to sleep then. Use. Sleep for a couple hours. I doubt it, the radiation should be cleared by tomorrow. It's a very high chance it's not. Oh, well, apparently it is. Several questions arise for me. A. Where did the nuclear bomb come from? The war is long over and the bomb will have hardly taken the wrong direction. And B, do I want to stay here? But that question is easy to answer. Absolutely not. But there's a bunker. Where are we going now? Leave the area. Fucking happy to. Just destroyed and everything. So, am I going I go this way? Seems so. To all employee employees, as strangers have been repeatedly seen on the premises, this door remains closed. You can pick up the key in the bunker. Good thing I already did that. Well, I don't mind being the woods during the day. It's not so bad because I can actually see what I'm looking at. Forest in the night is a no go. No, thank you. I refuse. A bridge made of boards. Now, these might not be the planks that saved my life, but they are the planks that prevent me from being up to my neck in water. I still want to know where that new came from. Can I pick lock these? Oh, I can use a gauge for egg beating. Okay. How can I pick up pills? What do I. What don't I need? Am I even... Oh, I got pills anyway. Now that I think about it, I'm not going to carry that heavy, bulky stuff around. I'm sure wherever that trip ends up, I'll find something there that will help me. Wait, what? You're now leaving the air. If you keep walking, there is no turning back. All materials for the construction of the camp cannot be taken away. And the fucking camp is gone anyway. Oh, there we go. I mean, literally, my, my camp was destroyed. There was nothing there, so... Yeah, it's fine. You know, the nuke explosion makes sure to take care of all set. that. I'm certainly not going to spend another night in the woods. I should get going and leave the forest. Yeah, I, uh, I refuse to uh, leave the forest. You don't have to ask me fucking twice, honestly. I would hate to be in the forest doing apocalypse. 
No, it's not a, it's not a great place to be. Oh. If you want to have a look, I'm back to civilization. Just in time before the night makes its grand entrance. Yeah, but is there people here? Or is everyone dead? Hello? That thing looks like a shabby cabin, and that's it. It must have been here since the 15th century, the way it looks. I think as soon as I touch it, it'll collapse. Is anyone alive? Hello? It's all gonna be, uh... Contaminated, isn't it? Yeah, there's just no point. It's all gonna be contaminated. Every single bit. Yeah. Hello? Anyone here? Anyone alive? Anyone speaking? Is there any undead here? I need to know before I move on. I would prefer if there was no undead here at all though. Hmm. Don't know why I got this out, I don't need it out. Alcohol! Ooh! Oh, we can get fucking hammered. Thank it. Yeah. So there's no one here at all. Vinegar! Don't know what I could do with vinegar in a time like this. Probably drink it. Oh, canned food. I don't want fucking canned food. I want a gun. Give me some sort of weapon immediately before I lose my mind. Don't need any more food. I just need a weapon. Fucking give me one, you bastards. Ugh. Nope. What does this say? Explore the village. Oh, I fucking am, believe me. I'm exploring the village, but it's fucking shit. One day everyone's dead, they had no weapons. I don't need to know who killed these everyone off, because I already know what it was. It was the zombie booze. The zombie people came in, ate everyone, and the people couldn't defend themselves because they had no guns. What I still can't get my head around is where the nuclear bomb came from last night. Don't know. The perfect place for my camp. Oh, I'm set up. But dinner will have to wait. First, I have to build up the camp. So I need one more fabric and two more straw. Why don't I just camp in one of these houses? <sighs> I don't know why I don't just camp in one of these buildings. Like, wouldn't that be easier? Oh, it's that thing. I mean, wouldn't that make sense? Like, the camp in these buildings? Because they're already sheltered uh. anyway. Oh, it's just... Oh, no, it's common sense. Found it. Right, okay, right. I managed to find everything for a camp. So there we go. Oh, I need... I need one more food. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't mind to cook some food. Um. Alright, uh, right, let's build this real quick. There we go. So, uh, I need to cook some food, so I need... 
Oh, so I need one more. Like, fuck. I don't think I found any more. Cause I've searched this entire village. It might be boned. Well, all these can be contaminated, aren't they? Oops. Yeah. Doesn't matter, this is uh there's there's literally nothing here for me, so Unless Oh fuck's sake. Damn it. Guess we. Well, I don't know if we need to sleep. It's still. No, we need to sleep. Let's just sleep. Good sleepy guys. I literally searched the entire town, I couldn't find any guns or anything. Like, this village is actually crap. Oh my god. Fucking bear? Why? Why does it have to rain now? Haven't I been punished enough already? I can't expose myself to rain that long. It might be contaminated. I should shelter myself from time to time. Time to go. Mm -hmm. Yep, it's time to go. I have to go upstairs, but only one floor won't be enough. The bear will still smell me. I have to go all the way up, onto the roof. Onto the roof? Oh god, onto the roof. I can't, I can't remember the roof is. Oh, here it is. Ha ha. All the way up to the roof, all the way up to the roof, all the way up to the roof. Oh god, my thing is gone. I'm dead. I died because of the rain. Fuck. Oh my god. Oh, I'm close. No, get up the ladder, get up the, la get up the ladder, please! Oh, okay. Ooh, that was close. We need to keep on going. Huh, this looks good. Sometimes you have to be lucky. Sorry. Oh, there we go. The if the bear managed to get up here into this room, I'll be very shocked. Oh, it's daytime. I know. This is a safe place in the region. If you are exposed to danger, you are safe here. Thank you very much. So, rain is bad. We've established that. Okie dokie. Okay, I believe that I'm going to end the game here. So, if you guys enjoyed me, you should like and subscribe. Uh, my thoughts on this game, um, it's okay. Like, this game's alright. It could be a bit better. Like, you could have more freedom. Uh, you know, you could, like, have more open world to it. Like, go, like, you know, like, Fallout or something. Like, that type of open world. You, know, you can find like guns or whatever, but I don't know. It's kind of a hassle to build campsites and all that. Cause you gotta find so much stuff, and I to half it, I don't think you really need. Uh, so yeah. So if you guys enjoyed, me should like and subscribe, and we'll pick up this second part hopefully soon, because I want to see some undead people. I want to see them. They are here somewhere, but I don't know where. And I need a gun. But hopefully we can all do that in the next video. So guys, I'll catch you guys then. See ya.